black-eyed bastard knew that when my blade stilled the Empress's heart and delivered her daughter to the Lord Regent's men, everything would fall to pieces. He watched me do it anyway. And now the world's gone mad. Plague grinds the city down. Corruption rots. A mad killer roams the streets by night, seeking revenge. The Overseers have stormed my hideout in the flooded district. And I'm in a strange duel with a mad witch named Delilah for the fate of the Empire. I'd say I was being punished, but I know that the world doesn't punish wicked people. We make our choices and take what comes. And the rest is void. I can't say I wasn't warned. The men are recovering well from the attack, but they don't understand the danger they're in. My mother warned me never to make an enemy of a witch. Corvo, here to settle our debt. You understand, I won't make this easy for you. has returned with the information you requested. He's waiting for you below. Begging your pardon, Dowd, but I don't think it's safe to leave these overseers holed up in the refinery. It's a new game now. They know where to find us. We just have to make them afraid to. They're not afraid to die for their seven strictures. Them? No. But the men who give the orders are a different breed. All the same, I'd better give them a hand, just in case the prisoners try anything. Corvo 
goes out there, Dowd. It's a matter of time before he shows up here. He's got the Lord Regent's army to chew through first. What are you going to do when Corvo arrives? He won't make it past the Weepers and the River Crusts. The city's changed since he was the Royal Protector. If Corvo... Enough about Corvo. You should be preparing for Brigmore. As you wish. Taking prisoners is exactly the sort of thing I'm talking about. You don't have to remind me. It's Billy's doing that the Overseers found us. That wasn't Dowd. Dowd should have caught it. And now witches. He's not the man he was. Quiet. You're going to get us killed. Dowd. Ever vigilant, I see. Are we leaving soon to Brigmore? Interesting times, gentlemen. Overseers in the flooded district. Witches abroad in the city. Traitors in the ranks. I'd be nervous, too. Then I'd remember who killed the Empress in Dunwall Tower, and came out untouched. This will hold while we're away. Anything short of cannon fire. Let's hope it won't come to that. I've made a mess of the access ways. But it had to be done. If I come back, I'll take it all down. We'll be back. And then you can burn those Overseer drapes while you're at it. Thomas finished his scouting run. When you've talked to him, I'll give you the latest word from inside the prison. I found Lizzie Stride. Getting her to lend us her boat will be a bit complicated, however. She's in Coldridge. From what I hear, they've got enough on her to hold her for about a thousand years. Coldridge, we can use this. We'll get her out, and Stride will have to pay back the favor. 
We'll have our transport. Ready to leave, sir? Or should I wait? At your pleasure. After Corvo's escape, it's going to be more difficult to break into Coldridge. They've installed arc pylons, and they're blurring overseer music over the loudspeakers. Our talents will be suppressed until we get inside. I have other talents. Corvo set off an explosion on his way out. Blew out the main gate. They're still rebuilding. Last thing. There's an execution planned in the courtyard. Should draw a lot of eyes away from you. They know how to make a man feel welcome. Is it time to go, sir? <laughs>